All right, y'all, back at you. I was, uh, I'm out here in the garden, kind of just, uh, you know, picking around at stuff, doing some weeding, chasing off all the critters, and uh, kind of checking out all of our banana plants here. We, uh, if you guys check out our other videos, we collect uh, different varieties of bananas. I think we have maybe 19 varieties total. But we have eight or nine in the front garden here. Um, there's a Orinoco, we got some Dwarf Cavendish, uh, we got some Praying Hands, Mysore, I wanna say that's a Grand Nain. I think this is an ice cream. These are Mona Lisa's. I forget what this one is back here. I think it's a Devil Mahoney or something back there. But, uh, you know, we have fruit on, a, on several of them. Um, that, uh, you know, we're kind of just still waiting on. We got some more up here stuff. Um, but I was picking at um, the Dwarf Cavendish bananas here, just kind of picking around. I didn't even notice that we have a uh, free flag and a flag leaf right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. The, the flag leaf is the little one right there. And you know, you know, anyone who's into bananas knows that that means that we're about to get bananas on this. We're super stoked because uh, we have, I think, maybe four or five other varieties that have fruit on them right now, but we have yet to get uh, any off of our little dwarf Cavendish patch here. Um, we've gotten fruit off of some dwarf Cavendish uh, in the past, um, some other uh, on another property we have, but we, uh, we've only been in this property for maybe two years and haven't gotten fruit on these yet, but as you can see, we're about to get fruit on them here. And if you're not familiar with growing bananas, I'll, I'll show you guys. Um, you can see like these leaves right here and right here are the normal size leaves on this banana plant. But then it put out one right here that I didn't even notice um, is a is is a uh, the pre flag leaf. It's slightly shorter than these uh, than the longer ones than the average size leaf. And, and then I just noticed for the first time today that it put out a flag leaf right there. Um, and so I'm stoked and um, so that means we're gonna get fruit on this soon um, another way you can tell sometimes um, the flag leaf is a dead giveaway but you can also see the I don't know what you call this the crown or something on the on the banana plant here you see how fat it's getting um, compared to this other one here and that's another good indicator that it's about to throw out a flower here um, and, and then another way to tell, sometimes these are a dwarf variety, but sometimes these, these taller ones um, will also start to lean a little bit uh, before they put out a flower. Um, that's another way to tell. But, I mean, a surefire way to tell is if you get a flag leaf like that. So, um, we're super stoked. You guys can see, this one looks like its newest leaf is just a normal leaf. So, this one's got a while to go, but... Uh, this one is definitely going to give us fruit soon, so. And we'll do, I'll do another video for you guys. Uh, we'll do kind of a tour. And we'll, we actually just got uh, four new varieties of bananas that we just planted in the backyard. So maybe in a week or so when this one fruits uh, or sets out a flower, uh, I'll do a, a tour of um, all the bananas we have around our property. Um, so like I said, we have, I think, 19 varieties now. This is a cool one up here. I don't know if you can see it, the praying hands super unique one but uh anyways y'all i just wanted to to show everybody what the uh pre-flag and flag leaves look like on a dwarf cavendish i know this is a real uh popular variety this is one of the main varieties you'd get at your big box store or at you know your average uh you know garden center or whatever um it's, it's a pretty easy variety to find and it's a uh, it's nice it's it's a manageable size um you can see these guys if if we get any heavy winds here um, from the tropical storms coming our way, it's, this guy's probably going to end up on the roof, but that's all right. It won't do any damage. It's not, these aren't that, you know, big or heavy of plants. So, but uh, like I said, I'll, I'll get a, uh, we'll get a video for you guys. Uh, we'll do a tour of all of the different varieties of bananas we have in a week or so when this flower pops out. But uh, till next time, guys, everybody out there, take care. <laughs>